Hi everyone, it's Rhonda at Ideal Body Image, Ideal Weight Loss in Georgetown today. It's on Monday morning. I've been playing with a little super, super easy recipe that I just wanted to take five minutes and show you. It it's, can be done with the bars, and you can be, do it with any bar. We've got the chocolate bar, the salted toffee, the lemon, the strawberry, even the fluffer nutter. Now, both of these bars, if I do it, they're only coated on one side, so I always flip them over and cut them. Um, we're just gonna do the chocolate because I think it turned out the absolute best, but they're all really yummy. Um, sometimes we just want a brownie or we just want something warm. So what I love to do is I open up my, I'm not about dishes, so I open up my wrapper here. And again, you can just cut it in half and then cut your half in half. I like to make them little mini brownie bites, if you will. So I cut it long ways like this and then I turn it and I cut it and then I stack these on top of each other and I cut them again. Now again, when you're at home and you've got your regular, um, like a cookie sheet, this is much easier. I just give my parchment paper a little spray and then you're just going to set your little cookies or brownie bites on here. Again, you want the, this one's coated on both sides, so there's really no right or wrong. If you're doing like the vanilla or the peanut butter or the salted caramel, which turns out quite fabulous, just make sure that your coated side is facing up. And then put these on your cookie sheet, 350 for five to seven minutes, middle rack, and you are going to have the funnest, let me just swap out here. I actually did a bunch, so I did all these bars just so we'd have tasters for the clinic. 355 to seven minutes. So this is the uh, brownie. This is the lemon bar. This is the salted toffee bar. You can see how it browns up. It's got a nice crisp. The lemon bar, and then this is the peanut butter bar. Um, and again, you, you know, you could have the whole row of one of these. I don't recommend making a big batch like this because the whole program is all about self-control. Plus, I love them warm. I think they're better when they're fresh out of the oven. But you can have, you know, eight little brownie bites or eight little, the strawberry ones and the lemon ones taste like little shortbread cookies. So, just something to mix it up, change it a little bit, something different, but fabulous. If you've got self-control and you want to make a big batch like this, do it. You could have one of each flavor. Something to have fun with. And then put the rest of them in your little Ziploc bag and stick them in the fridge. That's a little quick tip on how to stay on track and continue losing your weight with ideal weight loss here in Georgetown. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day.